guys, welcome to Aether Gazer. I'm going to give you guys a tour on my five day account showcase. So we'll be starting with what I have cleared so far in five days. And uh, let's go to operations. So for the main story, I'm actually 100% clear on normal up to the end. And I'm actually in hard mode already, clearing a couple, and uh, I'm at uh, going for broke. <laughs> so nearing, I think I'm in the middle already for hard. So that is where I'm at. But for the other content, supply, sigil, I won't go through this. These are just farming stages. For the challenges, however, I'm actually finished with um, tutorials, character tutorials, Grudges, I'm actually at three. So not really pushing this too hard. So I'm just playing it on, you know, if I'm if I'm up to it. And also casualty survey. I haven't been playing this. Um it's because I don't have time for the past few days. I just want a quick play. So I haven't really gone through most of the challenges. Dimensional variable. I'm at normal 3-2. Um, again, not really pushing. For recurring dream, I was able to clear uh, both for the previous one. This is the new one. This is actually going to be refreshing in four days. And for ha hazard zone, this is the one that I've been pushing. So I'm just waiting for a refresh because I'm actually after these. The vouchers here are very, very nice. So really pushing for the stage and I've used all the refreshes given by the game freely. So that is where I am with the challenges. And um, as far as Meow is concerned, I only have one more to unlock. So and I've been using. I think this one. This is what I've been using so far. So Meow. <laughs> meow the electric one um so that is it for operations uh meow and for the modifiers I, i'm gonna be you know um discussing with you guys what teams i've been using um i do have two teams because you need two teams to clear this content um recurring dream you'll need to have sets of two sets of teams so three and three because you won't be you can't use once you've used the first three you can't use them in the second one so that is why i have two sets of teams the first thing that i have is obviously shinri shinri and uh, shinku um are both um on my team they're on the first team usually they're the staple on the um they're staple in the first team and so far i have them at level 60 access keys at level 50 sigils some are 20 some are 30 and codes are all unlocked so first team again is going to be shinri shinku usually i would swap the third one either the third one would be rahu or jine or title song so those are my options for the third slot but i would normally use actually jene or rahu so jene and rahu would be my primary in my primary I'm team sorry. usually so if i go with the uh, shinri shinku i would also go with rahu if i if, if i want two separate teams on my second team, I would usually bring Janae, Title Song, and Sakubo. So it's really hard to to what do you call this? To read all of their names. They have two names, one up and one down. I'm sure that uh, Chokoyumi is actually her name, and this one is Bizunbu Tengu. So again. <laughs> Uh, sorry for if if I if, if I mix their names, but you get my drift. So one, two, one, two, three. This is my first team, main team, which I would swap 
um, as Asura with either Kotachi, <laughs> her name is too long, or I would swap with Poseidon. So that is my alternate, but standard is uh, Chukuyumi and Buzembu and Asura. Second team is one, two, and three. Chukuyumi would be the anchor for, you know, the, um, the third team that I have. So, um, again, if I am going to bring the, let's say if I have a primary team, I want more survivability, I would bring Chukuyumi, Asura, and Poseidon for the first team. If I want more, if I'm usually, uh, if I'm usually up, you know, um, fighting a boss, which is really, really hard. That I would bring. So, yeah. Chukuyumi, um, Asura, and Poseidon. If I am clearing content, let's say a lot of mobs, I would sometimes bring Chukuyumi, Buzenbu, and Kunino Tokotachi. <laughs> Shinei. They have so, so long names. So, they are usually used for mobs, which um, mobs are not really hard to clear. Um, they don't take, they, they, they don't hit you and your HP goes down that much. But for bosses, really, I would, I would prefer using this and this with this. Okay. I'm tired of reading all of their names. So again, that is my main two teams. The secondary ones that I tried to use was Hodor. Hodor was, well, I, I liked her to start. She was actually my starting character. But eventually, the DPS was too low, so I opted to level up others. Um, at this point, these are the ones that I've unlocked. I haven't built them. I don't have the luxury of building them because of the resources that I have. I do have one tier... Kagut, Kagutsuchi and uh, Okoninushi Oko, Oko and Poseidon, the Arctic Abyss. I, I, I want this one, the Poseidon Arctic Abyss, because of the freeze and the AOE. So, actually, at, at this point, I'm just waiting for new characters to come in. So far, I'm happy with uh, what I have in terms of this girl. Really happy how I built her. Understood. So, so far, that is it for my account. I'm actually cruising and more or less trying to farm daily, trying to level up more of my characters, especially my main ones, so that I could go further. I'm at level 52 at this point, and the guild that I am in is Myrmidon. This is actually a Filipino guild, so if you... You know, if you if if there are Filipino, you know, Filipinos are there who want to join the guild, um, there's actually a Facebook group that you can actually join as well. So that is it. I'm actually just uh, farming materials for the next banner. Nothing really, you know, uh, pushing me. I'm actually just finished summoning for the banners at this point. Not really looking to spend. So. That is it, guys. So I'll be farming after this one. I'll be playing. I haven't played today and I haven't played much yesterday. So thank you very much for staying this far. Take care. Stay safe. This is The Warden and I'm out of here.